Hi and welcome to this Blueberry Markets video update with me John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst. In this video we're going to take a look at the pound US dollar. I was asked to take a look at this uh, from the comment section on YouTube. So if you do have any suggestions of any markets that you do want to see, please comment below and I'll get around to them at some point. So as you can see here on the left hand side I have the weekly time frame and we can see down here in 2016 that was the uh, brexit lows so we had brexit here the market then had that fat finger incident where the market just dropped and uh, spiked back higher and uh, the market has found a bottom here and we and we rallied we retested this uh, in august 2009 and the market rallied again and we're heading right back towards these 2019-2016 lows which we highly anticipate the market to reach. Look on the right hand side of the screen you can see we have the hourly time frame and uh, the market is just nicely making its way down into this area. Now we may see some short term buying from these lows as it is a large significant level what we do have to be aware of is the fact that the market is increasingly uh, buying us dollars so if we go over to the weekly chart here on the dollar index you can see the market is still continuing to push higher as we outlined in the market outlook this week and if the market does take out that hundred area on the dollar index then dollar is going to continue to push higher and head towards the 103s now this uh, increase in US dollar strength could continue to put pressure on the pounds and if it takes those lows out we could be seeing further downside um, at that point we're kind of moving into blind territory there but we'll have to wait and see what actually happens here um, to try pound at the moment it's been quite nice in terms of breaking through some key lows typically we get um, a bit of side wise movement and then uh, the drop happens so just keep monitoring these sorts of areas these sorts of zones look for the retest when the market breaks out and then you can see here the market just continuing to move lower and lower and lower so what i'd suggest now is the market is going to likely test that 1.2 area and if we do get any kind of significant rally perhaps back into 122 then I'd look to short the pound um, back down into that 1.2 area. I don't see much upside to this market at the moment, so I wouldn't necessarily be looking for those buying opportunities. The only way I'd look for buying opportunities now is if this weekly time frame, uh, for instance, gave us a reason to maybe if the market formed a sort of bottom like it did in 2019 where we had sort of uh, buying candles come back into play that would be ideal then to look for long opportunities but right now um, only looking for shorts on this market so i hope you enjoyed this video update with me john kibler head currency analyst if you did please like and subscribe to the youtube channel for more trading content and i'll speak to you soon